Greetings from the land of Canada, my name is Nooch, and welcome back to my Fallout 4 Let's Play. Uh, yeah, I basically want to go over, before this video just gets started, where has the, uh, where has the Let's Play been? Um, oh my god, that's a lot of red on my minimap, and apparently I'm in danger. Oh well. Uh, basically, I want to let you guys know what happened to my Let's Play. Uh, basically, I hit a standstill. I couldn't, I hit a little bit of a roadblock in, in the storyline couldn't figure out where to go and I didn't feel like looking up everything with, like how to do it and everything so I just sort of wanted to wait until I get, got my new computer and then that got held back so long so I had to basically well, I didn't have to but I waited on that and honestly I probably could have brought you guys uh, this series a little bit sooner but that being said I'm glad that we have it now so that's all that really counts and the, the, what's it called? The mission that I was doing was the railroad. You have to find the, the, the railroad. And it was really hard to do because they had gave you zero hints at all on your minimap. And I've been letting the minimap sort of carry me. Okay, enemies have a harder time detecting you while you're sneaking and not moving. Interesting. And it's actually uh, a flat upgrade, I think. Um, I'm gonna take that short combat rifle. Looks like it could do some damage. Oi! Okay, so we're actually just gonna put this back on. Yeah! Uh, flat upgrade. Fantastic. Um. Yeah! Sure! I'll take a piece of legendary armor that turns me invisible. What? <laughs> That's imbalanced. <laughs> what? I can't even read. I can't even read my thing. Mel, right arm? We're gonna take it. Oh, the no scope. Get owned. Oh, no scoping for days. So good. All right. Sorry. I don't like talking with my mouth full. I'm actually totally eating Skittles right now. But yeah, that's super cool. This piece of armor is amazing. Okay. So yeah, you need to go to the north, north, whatever tower. North old old north tower. That's what it's called. I could never find this place. It was ridiculous. Oh Man, I was actually shocked that they did that and uh, Here we are now though. Um, I actually just wanted to fight some some of those enemies. Uh, that was actually amazing What an amazing drop Because um, I'm actually very stealth focused you know, stealth centric in my uh, in my character build at least on at least on this character and on my other character as well, I actually enjoy stealth a lot. It's because you don't get many good stealth games anymore. And um, whenever I can implement that into a game that I'm playing, I will uh, I will do that. Also, I should probably stop eating this because I think it's going to be really nasty to just hear like, mmm, mmm, mm, Skittles, mmm, so good. Mmm. Okay. All right, we're good. We're good, we're good. Burnt Lifestyle Magazine, no thank you. Do I have a good melee weapon? That's the question. Because I remember, I remember, is, was it on this account? Okay, actually, I'm going to run through some of my weapons because I haven't played on this uh, character in a very long time. Um, do I have short double-barreled shotgun? I actually have a bunch of shells for that, too. That's nice. Short combat rifle actually looks like um, a pretty sick weapon. So I'm going to go ahead and put that there. And quick... Powerful hunting rifle. Is that the one that I'm using as a sniper right now? Probably. Pulse grenade. Lots of damage. Uh, nocturnal hunting rifle. Does increasing amounts of damage as the night grows longer and less damage during the day. I don't even remember getting that. <laughs> what? That's so weird. Okay. And that one actually has night vision on it, but... Kellogg's pistol, of course. We got Tony the Tiger's handgun. Let's just go. And Assassin's laser musket. Pretty nice as well. But I... I think what we're going to do is actually just take out my short double barreled shotgun and if we find because I'm probably gonna end up finding like rad roaches or something in here or some ferals wow this gun sucks wow this gun super sucks oi that's a legendary ghoul um I'm gonna let that guy tank it up a bit and we're gonna see how much damage we can do by macheting him. That's hilarious. We cut off his arms. I'm gonna cut off his legs as well. Can I cut off your leg? <laughs> He's just 
just like headbutting me. What a jerk. That's super cool though. I actually forgot that you can do that in this game. This game's amazing. Ghoul Slayer's metal left arm. Let's go. Uh, reduces damage by ghouls by 15%. Cool. Uh, the, in the thing is, will this be any better than what I have? Yes, it is. Thank you. I actually will take that. Silver table knife. That's actually pretty good. It contains silver, which is, I think, a rare uh, item. This is awesome. <sighs> Going invisible like this just all the time. I'm so happy I found this. Okay, uh, I will continue exploring in this area, and I, since I read the, the guide on how to do it, because I had no idea where to go, and I didn't feel like wait, taking like 18 hours to actually find it, um, am I going the right way? I'm, I'm, I think I am, because I'm following these things. So, once we get, uh oh, it's a roamer. We're invisible now. So this guy's screwed. We're going to one-bang him. Oh, bopped. Cool. Can we go through here? This is, what does it say? Peter Saint, uh, it looks like Saint. Medayard, George Clark's tomb, 1808. Hmm. I, this is, I guess this is like a cemetery, like a sort of resting ground for, uh, people of interest, I guess. Um, we're gonna go ahead and turn this on, yeah. And is there anything over here? Oh, there's a crate. Right away, sure. Honestly, I'll take it. Uh, that looks like a stim pack. Okay, <laughs> it's not a stim pack. Oh, he's totally asleep. Okay, I had a feeling. <laughs> I was like, it's not letting me loot this body, and I know that uh, Pharaoh Ghouls like sleeping, so. Oh, I totally just chopped his leg off. Wooden block, LND. It looks so cool as a title, but it's the lamest thing ever. Okay, this is what we need. Okay, this is what the picture is. Okay, and there's nowhere to go either. Okay, so what you need to do with this, um, the Freedom Trail, Boston, yeah. So we need to turn this to R. So we're gonna do this. We're gonna do that. Rail. I L and it's got to spell railroad. So let's go back to R. And over to O. Oops. And then where's the closest A? I think this is it. Oops, wrong way. R O A and then where's D? Over here. So this should work. Nice. Did it, boys. We made it. The Let's Play can continue. Aww, yeah. Let's do it. Okay. So, they're gonna try to kill me, I think, and then I'm gonna slay them all. Could be wrong. I am I have a plate of Skittles in front of me, and I'm gonna resist eating them, because I know that it's gonna destroy all, like, integrity of commentary whatsoever, because it's all gonna be gross. Can I actually just walk up and talk to you? Put down the guns! <laughs> I have no shirt on? What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm gonna make something up. Imagine if that worked. She's just like, oh, Carl! I remember him. Um, um, screw it. Dr. Let's just get this over with. Very interesting. Last question left. Why cool. Are you here? A, f a full story to the point. Let's just go. There you go. <laughs> he's, she's like, what are you fucking say? Yo, look how cool this guy is! He's like a biker! What the fuck? <laughs> what? <laughs> Why does he look so cool? <laughs> like, he's... <laughs> he's so out of place. He's so cool that he's like... Like, unreasonably out of place. Okay. This guy... Look, look at him! What the fuck? He's got like aviators on and shit. Look at his head. Look at his hairstyle. Oh my god. That's hysterical. Oh my goodness. 
<laughs> Everybody else has like all of this like like post apocalyptic attire. This guy's rocking like a polo and like <laughs> some aviators. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm sitting here with a freaking gas mask on. Uh, diplomatic. I don't know. I wasn't listening to a single thing they were saying, but uh, that's why. Look at this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like one of those douchebags that would show up to a poker game. It's like the first poker game he's ever been to with like a new group of friends or whatever, and he's bringing his shades. Like he's just bluffing everybody, and nobody likes him. Discuss the details about your chip inside. Cool. Let's do it. You are swanky af, and you are rocking, of course. Like he's like see he's he's like normal. These two look normal. He does not look normal. <laughs> like in this day and age, in this setting, this is normal. This looks totally all right. You are so fucking out of place, buddy. Oh my god. All right, that's hysterical though. Cool. Let's continue. Let's continue. Let's keep on keeping on. I don't even want to talk to you. You're not being followed anymore. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so, say goodbye to the storyline, all semblance of that. I even forget what the storyline- I was trying to, trying to find Sean, that's right. I can't believe I remember what his name was. You! Up. Let's get a look at this. No, 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 no. You out there, Been out of the loop. The need to check out this courser chip. Now, if you need or, no, 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 this is- see, I, I- okay, hold on, no, not interested, I don't care. I don't care. I need to find Tinker Tom. Where's Tinker Tom? Where's Tinker Tom? Is this Tinker Tom? Don't try anything, nope. Stranger. What about you, buddy? Nope. Uh, where is my boy? That's actually just a robot that can talk to you. Oh my god. Um, this place looks like it'd be fun to loot, honestly. It also, I also have weird feeling that there's gonna be a bobblehead in here, somewhere. Like, yeah, I, no spoilers, but I have a feeling, definitely, that there's gonna be a bobblehead. So keep your eye out. Definitely keep your eye out. And, like, just spam comments if you see it, honestly. Just go go, go nuts. Go nuts in the comments if I missed a bobblehead. Go nuts anyways in the comments. Why not? It's fun. Um. So what are we doing? We have to find Tinker Tom. Are you Tinker Tom? Hello, sir! What the fuck? Are you fucking busy? Are you serious? Um, you know, you guys can clean up a bit around here. There's a corpse just chilling. This is actually really weird. Um, I have a feeling that this is either a game glitch or something. Um, yeah, okay, all right. He didn't, he wasn't actually supposed to be just there. All right, you're gonna knock this over. Bobblehead? Toy alien and a toy rocket ship. It says for me to find it, so sure. Or I'll pick up a toy rocket ship. Okay, are you talking to him? Desdemona. Great name, great name. This guy looks like a freakazoid. I'm glad that he's the one that we need to talk to and not whoever this is. Sleeping on the job. Come on. Come on, let's be real. Are you done just hanging out and not doing anything, please? Please, please. Of course, a chip. Wait, what? Hello. Uh, yeah, take it. Screw it. Screw it. All right, Tom. Make it happen. Go, 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 go. Don't try anything, stranger. Sweet. I wish I had subtitles so I could tell what this guy's saying. But like, I'm just gonna watch him do this thing. This is actually interesting. I like how animations like this get better and better with each year, each game. Because sometimes it's like. And it's just, you're, they're clearly not doing anything, but this actually looks like he's... You know what this little device looks like? If anybody's watched Rick and Morty, uh, season 2, in like episode 2, the one where he has his, uh, his old girlfriend or whatever that he meets, and at the end of the episode, spoiler, spoiler alert, this looks like the machine that he used. Um, does it not look like the machine he used? It's like, it's like, it's, it looks very, very similar. Even this, even this, it looks it, like the crystal, right? This is extremely similar. Maybe I should bring up a, a picture to show you guys, honestly. I might just do that, but I don't like editing in my Premiere Pro program. I love editing in my Sony Vegas program, but Premiere Pro? Um, 
very, very hassle. It's full, very hassle. And I don't know how to do all the crazy tricks I can do in Vegas. Okay. Start working on the rest of the chip. And you, I'd love to work with you more. Let me know if you're interested. And all of a sudden, she's happy that I broke into her area. Cool. Otherwise, our relationship will be in jeopardy. Oh no, not our relationship! And you! What'd you find? Okay. So what's the plan? Where are we going? You, hey. you, you, you. If we're going to be dealing more with each other, I need to make She has those very seductive bedroom eyes right now. I don't know. That could be just be me. Look at her. Look look at her. It's what? <laughs> She's not... All right. Um full details. Let's go. I've heard rumors. What are they? The institute, the institute created them synthetic humans. They're mostly organic part machines. Somewhere along the line they became more than just con constructs. They think, they feel, they act just like you and me. The Institute treats since its property as tools. Slavery is wrong, but they're machines, so it's like a very, very, very gray area. The only question that matters is would you risk your life for your fellow man, even if that man is a, thin, is, is a synth? That's a tough question. Like, in the game, I feel like I'd just say I'd risk my life just to get the karma from, um,. From Valentine, but like IRL, I don't know what I would do. I, I think that if it's like if it was part machine, like say it was my friend and he was in an accident and like he had to get like ninety percent of his body replaced with a brain with, with like uh, um, a machine or something. But like there's still ten percent of him that's him. It feels like my best friend. Sure, I'd risk my life for it, honestly. Yeah, see, look, he's down. He he digs it. Cool. Cause like uh, I don't know, the future the future's bright. In terms of like technology and stuff, so you never know. One day it might happen. Ooh, we leveled up. It's hold you hold B to level up. What's the level up button? I think we go to this. That's no, why. Okay. I have so much strength and perception on this character, and zero charisma. <laughs> no wonder I missed all the different. Uh, persuasion attempts. Okay, so what am I actually going for? I'm level 15 at the moment. Uh, I actually was shooting people through walls. Cool. I actually don't even know why I have this perk. <laughs> uh, sniper. Cool. Gun basher. Why do I have no high tier perks here? Um, and like, this is my highest thing. Night person. I love how that's the perk that I chose. I have to be level 25 for the next level though. I like this. I like the ninja. I like the ninja perk. It's cool. Um, should I just go for this? Oh, I love the sneak perks. Okay, we're just gonna go for it. And now that I can turn invisible when I'm crouching, it's even better. What's the next rank? Yeah, 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 yeah. Sweet. Okay. So what are we... Trade crafts. Talk with Deacon. Deacon. Sounds like... Well, maybe not sounds like, but looks... The word looks like bacon. <laughs> Uh, I don't believe Deacon is actually Watch in this outside. room. Oh, is Deacon the crazy looking biker dude with the... Yeah, it is, huh? Wow. I have to go talk to that guy? <laughs> Alright. Let's see if we can use our dialogue to out-douchebag him. That would be hilarious. Alright, listen, Deacon. <laughs> he looks like fucking Phantom Lord! I just got it! I just fucking got it! <laughs> Oh my god, I'm fucking cracking up right now. Holy shit. I found Phantom Lord in Fallout 4, guys. That's fucking hilarious. Uh, I'm just gonna forgive you. Whatever. Whatever. Exactly. Kind of killed our chance of Sup, Phantom Lord. How you doing, man? Looking good. I like the shades. <laughs> Ah, uh, Deacon. Thanks. Vouch for me? So tell me, why did you vouch for me? I've heard a lot of things about you. Arg. Enough to want to give you a chance. So Des wants me to make you a tourist. This was a bit of a What a waste. I'm just going to come out and say this. The railroad needs you. Okay, all right, all right, all right. I'm just going to take a job because I don't know what else to do, so let's do it. Okay, meet Deacon at the old highway. Interesting. But 
But I don't care. I actually don't want to do any of these missions. Uh, I think the more important thing that we want to do right now is the molecular level. Return to Virgil. So I'm going to uncheck this. Uh, definitely going to go to Virgil and see what we can do. Okay. Ooh. Is that going to close it? Oh, that'd be cool. If I can open and close that door. Alrighty then. Alright, well, this is cool. I've, I've dropped two sick references on you guys so far, which I'm s I'd be surprised if the majority of uh, whoever's watching understands them. But if anybody gets that Rick and Morty reference, I'm sure uh, you would see exactly what I'm talking about. And as for the Phantom Lord, that's just banter. <laughs> so, let's go. Let's go to the North End. We're almost there. And honestly, I'm thinking of keeping this episode short just because I'm a little bit of on a, I'm a little bit on a time constraint right now. I don't like I don't like doing that though. I don't like cutting my videos short because of other stuff. So I'm gonna take this as far as it goes. Uh, which right now means we need to return to Virgil, which I believe is what? Oh my God, are you serious? Okay, fine. I will teleport all the way to the Rocky Cave. I think that's the most southwestern area in the game. Here. And I, if I remember correctly, I fought a freaking Deathclaw out there. So let's go. Let's go. Let's go inside. Yeah. Let's we'll go inside where it's safe. Where it's nice and safe. Cool. Now you don't freak out and try to kill me again because you're unkillable and that's not a fair fight. So hello. Yep, I think so. I have the code. Suppose I shouldn't be surprised. You it's did funny, what do you mean? So jokes. Uh, this game has like very like dark-ish humor. Cause it's like this is used to be a dude, right? And like he had poor eyesight, so he's wearing his glasses, but it looks so charming on like this this crazy super mutant. Alright, so we're just gonna say railroad helped me. Doop do doop do do those kooks. Just have something of a reputation. Cool. Not the only one. Nice. The best, the best I could from memory to things I've overheard through the years. Came up with, Came up with some schematics for you. It wasn't easy. These hands are ridiculous. These Fine motor skills ridiculous. have gone to shit. Very true. Uh, here's the symbol explanation. You build a device that will hijack the signal the Institute uses to teleport coursers and send you instead. You know the craziest part of the design? That classical music station. That's the carrier signal cool. for the relay. So all like the on harmonic frequencies. You've been hearing it all along. Are like all that music? Clear that this isn't my area. I was bioscience, not engineering of advanced systems. Good enough. For the record, I haven't made any promises. But if you can build make use of the code, you should be able to override the signal from the institute's relay. Sweet. I mean, can I build it? Can, can build you have people it? that can help? You There's like there's like four people. There's I, since I read the guide. There's like four options for this. So, um, I got it covered, buddy. Good. Uh, good. Yeah. Because you've got to make it in there, for both our sakes. Yeah. He I wants to live. I need my kid. Payment. And I've helped you as best I can. If you uh, I think I'm gonna need help to do this. I'm gonna need to ask somebody for some, for some, normal, some aid. So you find it. Now go on. Take these and get to work. You do whatever it takes. Okay. The only guy that I actually, the only people that I have a decent relationship with in this, on this character, is actually no, they're all equally like nothing. Like they're, I all, I equally have zero relationship with any of these people. Nothing with the railroad. Nothing with the Minutemen. Nothing with the Brotherhood. So basically, I can like flip a coin or something or I guess there's three of them so I can't do that um I can do anything just eeny meeny miny mo for these guys to see who I can pick so um I can just pick whoever I want and that doesn't really matter how do I do this how can I do this because I want this to be RNG I actually do want this to be RNG and what's the best way of doing that I wish I had a dice oh, if I had a dice with me I could be like Four and five is railroad. Uh, three and four is Minutemen, and one and two is Brotherhood. I wish I had a dice. Uh, not much, not much chance stuff going on. 
Oh, well, we'll just go to the railroad because I know where those guys are. So, okay. Whatever. No RNG today. I'll just make an executive decision. What's in your trunk over here? I could totally go invisible. Steal your money. <laughs> and Valentine's like, nah, G. Not cool, man. And then we're going to be like, whatever. I needed the caps. <laughs> but literally, no, we don't. Okay. Ah. What can you even... Like, you know what's weird? It's so strange because I love Fallout 4 and there's really nothing... That, like, the currency in this game is so insignificant. It's crazy. Okay, we're going to head back to the railroad. Or... <gasps> Wait, what? I haven't seen Sanctuary in a while. It's only at 75, really? Yeah, whatever. Minutemen. Who do you think would actually help me out the most with this? This is such a tough decision. Alright, whatever. I'm going to go with plan A. Which was uh, the railroad. Just found these guys and it took forever to find them. So literally you can go back and see what my last Fallout, uh, Fallout 4 Let's Play episode was. That's how long it took to find the railroad, guys. <laughs> that is how long. Alright, we got this. We got this. I, I wish I had more fusion cores because I, I can never use my power armor because I, I never have any. I'm like, I've got like three left or something. It's crazy because I, I was watching a Twitch uh, live stream like uh, when Fallout 4 first came out and it looked like the guy had been playing for a couple of days and he was just walking around in power armor and I was like, oh, this is kind of cool. And it turns out he had like 90 or something fusion cores and I was like, well, that is imbalanced. Um, <laughs> that being said, I guess it's not too imbalanced because uh, there's other well i mean it's a little bit imbalanced this is a little bit imbalanced i wish i could do that i wish i could just walk around in full fusion core armor and just like de deplete all my fusion cores but i have no idea where to even find them it's crazy okay all right listen listen i'm only gonna ask once give me the courser chip okay maybe that wasn't a question but still i'm only gonna say this once please help me Okay, all right, we did it. Nice. We we made we constructed a sentence that made sense. Sweet. Now you guys, uh, where are we actually going here? Nice. And this is actually still super close. We're gonna run through this dialogue so we can get to some fighting. Apparently, this is like the second to last uh, mission in the game. So, signal interceptor. Get to the institute. I'd be skeptical I'm from a stranger listening all these Cool. Where is where is where is uh um where's Phantom Lord? We need to find this guy. Why do I still have to talk to her? We'll file out separately after you leave. Best not to attract attention. Derp a derp derp derp. Okay, fine. Listen. Listen, we need to walk up to Phantom Lord and be like, bro, listen. <laughs> I know you like playing League of Legends and everything, but you're going to help me with this. You're going to take time out of your day so you can make this happen. Where are you? Where is this guy? I wouldn't be surprised if he's over here shooting stuff. You gotta be Look at this. Man. It resets every time you walk in and out. And it resets glitched into the freaking wall. <sighs> Whatever, man. It's all good. It's all good. Oh, is this... No. Are you eating ramen? <gasps> Give me some. Give me some! Oh, that looks amazing! Uh, actually, in, in this game, it looks pretty gross, but... <laughs> I, I love ramen. It's actually one of my favorite foods. But... For now, we're trying to keep our eye open for... As weird as a robot. It was over here, now it's over there. It's so creepy. Okay. Where is my boy? Where's my boy? P Where's PL? Where's Phantom Lancer? I need to find this guy. For some reason, if the, the waypoints in this game are so messed up sometimes. I seriously cannot tell where to go. Because it's going to tell me to talk to Desdemonda or whatever. And... But... Where's... Where's the homie, you know? Where's the homie? Wrote you. I get to do a full security suit before Can't talk to you. <coughs> you didn't see anything. Speak. Can't talk to you. Desdemona. This is absurd. Is she smoking and shit? Gross. Um. 
dead end, of course. Uh, all right, I guess screw the railroad. Um, we're gonna go. We're gonna go talk to not the Brotherhood, but the Minutemen, the classic Minutemen. Oh, I forgot that I could sprint in this game. I bet a lot of people have been upset. <laughs> I actually completely forgot that you can sprint in this game. That's kind of funny. All right. Sweet. We're going back to Sanctuary. The classics. And hopefully the Minutemen will be able to help me as much as possible with this mission. Because I have no idea what to do. Zero idea. I have to build a teleporter device? Come on, guys. That's not easy. <laughs> All right. So Minutemen. You got this. I mean, I got this. And I hope they don't send me on, like, freaking missions to prove my worth. Because, like, I I've been on the Reddit. The the Reddit, guys. The Fallout 4 subreddit. Where everybody talks about stuff like that. And it's like a meme. That the Minutemen, the Minutemen um, their missions suck. So, I guess that's kind of funny. Anyway, but listen. I'm busy. Don't no, I don't care. What do you need, General? You... Are gonna help me with a signal interceptor. Here to build a in the Institute. Why would you want to go mess around with them? Because I have big guns and no shirt, and I'm gonna destroy them. They kidnapped my son. Damn. Some bad business. <laughs> Don't worry about that. Now, assuming you could build this thing. What exactly does it do? Teleportation. Uses teleportation to get in. Yeah. This mission. Teleportation. For real? For real? Yep, yep, yep. How the Institute managed to operate. If anyone can work. Yeah, Sturges doesn't like me though. Okay. Yeah. You are tired. And like at least here we have a waypoint that we can talk to. He doesn't look like Phantom. What the fuck? He just teleported. Preston. He's got the like Phantom Lord hair. Everybody in this game looks like Phantom Lord all of a sudden. What you got? <laughs> here you go. Wow. What a mess. Okay. So are you gonna build this for me? It's real. I got it from an accident. Seriously? You know, you're gonna access the suit and still be breathing. Yes, anyway, very true. The eggheads never think about the nuts and bolts of actually making cool. something work. I'm gonna need some time to study this thing. The handwriting's pretty hard to make out. Uh, Do-do-do-y. You can get started on what he calls a stable... Uh, uh -huh. some pretty high-grade metal. But it's basically not that different than the lining of... Woof. Okay. Good work, well, don't thank me yet. I think some time I to work out the details. Here's a list of what you need. Okay. Pretty sure, sure we've got, got all that accentuary if you want to build it there. Uh -huh. While you're working on that, Literally, I'm we're inside Sanctuary, bud. Actually build the rest of this thing. Keep in mind, I can already see this is going to take a cool. Uh -huh. Like if That's we good. had a spare nuclear reactor handy, <laughs> we could probably I'll build one, don't worry. <laughs> and it's going to be big. So find a nice right. Cool. That's right. Awesome. We're on the way. We're on our way. And if we're going to Okay. Special. Cool. Big open area. Big open area. Right in the middle of the street. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Done. <laughs> no, no, no. It's this, right? It's this to get out? Hold B? Okay, we're good. Look at this thing. This is where I'm teleporting. Cool. That's kind of awesome. All right, we're building it. No, listen, Thanks you don't get no no sleep. No shh, sleep. Still shh, Brooklyn. Shh, down, down. Who listens you listen to the Beastie Boys? Probably nobody. <laughs> Figure out plans. Yes. Ready to build the rest of it. Good. I've got a handle on this crazy contraption, contraption as at least as much as I can tell until we actually try to build it. Here's a list of three things we need to find. over at the building side and see if we can actually make this thing. Cool. Thanks. I'll get right on. Good deal. One thing to keep in mind while a you're telecom sites for a sensor module. It all needs to be wired together so all the pieces can talk to each other. Yep, okay. yep, yep. Okay. Let's do this. Can I place this down? Holy crap. Um. We actually have all the information for this, so that's interesting. That's good. Um. Okay. We'll put this here too. Yo, this is hella cool. <laughs> How cool is this? Hella. Um, are we actually just good? Power it up, huh? K. 
Okay. Wait, no, not decorations. Power. How? Whoa, wait a minute. One, two, five, twenty? So we need twenty-eight power. What can we... What, what's a good generator? This produces three, five, ten. Oh, we need a lot of aluminum, I think. Maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, this is five. So if we get six of these, can we afford six of these? We, we can, I think. Hype. Okay, we're going to put these all right here, just in a line. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Now we need wiring, which I believe we can just do with Y. Yeah, okay, you, you go here. Are you serious? It's too, it's too, it's too short. Wait, no, never mind. Is it connected? Nice. And you go to this, you go to this. We're actually just gonna get this guy all geared up, ready to go. Oh yeah. Oh dude, that looks so cool. Nice. Sweet. Okay, so I believe that's already powered up. Requires just one. Wait a minute. I can't connect it to this somehow for some reason. So this is, wait a minute, assigned to, yes, requires, requires, oh, he's already working on it. This needs to be powered. This is powered by one thing. I am the worst at wire management, by the way. Anybody who has ever seen um, any sort of computer built by me will vouch for that. Why can't I power this? Why can't I tell? I can't power this. What's happening? I actually can't. I think you guys are hearing me mash the the Y button. Eh. I can attach it to this. I don't want to though. I can't seem to. Whatever, man. Cool. So all this stuff's powered. Like, it all looks super powered, but... There's, like, uh, something going on. Something going on here. Uh, this guy has it. Do I have to connect the wires to each of them? Because look, I, I can take this and connect it to here. Connect it to here. Okay. I can take this and I can't connect it to there for some reason. can connect that to that though. This platform is rip. I don't know what the point of this is. If I stand under here, am I going to take damage? I don't think so. I don't know, guys. I'm scared. I'm scared. Uh, so hold on. What's my objective? That's usually a good place to start. Oops. Power up the signal interceptor. That's what this thing is, right? Gotta make sure we've got enough power. That's what this thing is. Sure what is this? Thing? It's, not it's not letting me. The rest of the signal interceptor. It's actually not letting me. So weird. Maybe it's a bug, honestly. Look at all of these wires. Savage. Um, yeah! <laughs> scared the shit out of me, but. <laughs> um. Like, I don't know, man. We're gonna, we're gonna store it. And I think we need to go back to special. Yeah, I know it requires that. But it's not letting me. Now it is! Wait, is it? This is the weirdest thing. 
No, I don't want that. No, 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 no. I want to delete this wire. Yes. Fantastic. And I can't connect this. Okay. Okay. We're stuck. We're stuck, guys. We're actually like... This is unfortunate. I don't know what the heck's going on. I think these guys are already all powered, right? Yeah, they start off being powered. Cool. I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Because this doesn't feel like working. This I think is working. Make sure the beam emitter is perfectly aligned with the platform, or this will never work. Wait, what? What do you say? Oh, thanks. I wish I had subtitles on, and I'm very glad that I have sound turned on. Okay, are you guys ready for this? Um, I'm gonna bring this over here. That's what needed to happen. Cool. So what up, fam? How you doing? Everything looks good on my end. You ready to see if this thing actually works? Yeah, send uh send what's his face first. Okay. No 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 no. Give him a cell phone. Give me the other give me a cell phone too so he can call me or a radio or whatever. Send him over to the institute and then give him give me a call when he's there, because I don't want to be the first one. I don't know this thing we fucking built it in like five minutes. I don't think that I don't think it's that safe. Screw it. We're going. We're gonna teleport. Arg. Okay. Dude, if I look, if I look straight up into that, am I my retina is gonna fuse together? Like. I figured this was a golden opportunity to find out as much as we can about the institute. Yep. What they're up to. Yeah, this, this holotape's all set with a program that will scan their network and download anything it finds. Cool. Yeah. Ow. Uh -oh. uh, yeah, we better hurry. And don't worry about that tubing wiggling around. Yeah, seriously. Just there for decoration. Okay. Cool. Scanning for the institute signal. Tracking RF. Everybody's and watching. All right, three, two, one. Hold on to your one. butt. Thanks all for watching, everybody. Take it easy. Peace.